We always appreciate your time. Can you tell our viewers what you're most concerned about so far? Yeah, this morning and overnight, we had a lot of rain, especially in the northwestern portion of Harris County and into Waller County. And so we do have some elevated creeks in that area. Some of them are, are getting close to bank full. And uh, we may have some very minor overbank flooding on the upper portion of Little Cypress Creek and the upper portion of Spring Creek a little bit later this morning. This shouldn't impact anything more than just some rural areas near the creek and, and maybe some roads in that area. Um, and we have a lot of water we are draining off, both from the rains um, from Monday and also the rains overnight. So the creeks and bayous are high, they are elevated. But the good news overnight is that they were able to handle the rainfall that we, uh, that we picked up. Always good to hear that. Uh, Jeff, what can we expect tomorrow? Are we expecting a repeat of this? Yeah, that, there's a lot of uncertainty going forward as to where and when and how much additional rainfall we may see. As, as we kind of saw overnight, uh, we didn't get as much as we were thinking we might uh, get last night. And so going forward, it's just really uncertain when these rounds of storms may come through, how much rain they're going to produce. And, and really the key going forward is the rainfall rate uh, how quickly that rain falls. If we start talking two or three inches per hour, that can lead to really rapid flash flooding. And, and you know, it's just a big question of, did we get some of that this afternoon, tonight, or tomorrow? And really the overall pattern is favorable for some additional heavy rainfall even into tomorrow. So we're just gonna ask people to continue to monitor the forecast over the next couple of days. And it sounds like to be prepared for uh, some more rain, potentially, who knows how much at this point, I guess. Jeff, before you go, what's the most important thing that we should be doing this morning in the Houston area? Yeah, the biggest thing this morning is since we, you know, people are going to get out and they're going to go to work at school and everything like that. Just remember, if you come up to high water locations, don't drive into that high water, especially any of those underpasses. Uh, that water can be uh, fairly deep and we don't want uh, folks getting in trouble with high water their vehicles. All right, Jeff Lindner with Harris County Flood Control District. Thank you, sir. We appreciate your time. All right.